In the last two videos, we talked a little bit about the installation preparation for the Garmin Phantom 24 radar. Now we're going to demonstrate the actual installation. Well, it's starting to get dark, and I know it's going to rain tomorrow, so I'm going to get the top off or the cover off, get the T-top measured, drilled, and get this bolted on, and then uh, I could get the cover back on. If it starts to rain, we can work under the cover to do the wiring. Okay, for this T-top, this and this measure pretty much the front and the back of the box. That means this will have to mount about right here, just behind this light. But because it slants back, it should be able to clear it. What we'll do is measure the center line now. Quarters, so the center line is going to be 16 and 3 eighths. 2 3 eighths. So that's the center line back here. Now, the copy is crooked, but we've centered the line so that we know where center is. Again, we don't want to get on those. So I'm going to go trim this down so that we have a good copy. Okay, so I've trimmed it down. Double check to make sure that it's square, so it doesn't matter which direction it's going. I lined up my mid lines, and now I'm going to just mark this. Two four back, two four forward. Okay, four marks. Now these are three eighths bolts, but I'm going to drill it with a quarter and then go down with the step bit because it's. Perfect. So we'll do we'll these two down. T top's just a little bit thicker there. Make sure our bolts fit. make holes for our cabling. Probably use the same hole for the power cable. So again, start with a smaller bit. Start off by bringing the cable 
up, putting it through our gasket. Gasket down. And bring the radome head up. We're going to then caulk these with 5200. Caulk these with 5200. Set the head down. Okay, so this is about how much cabling I would want out if I had to pull it and work on it. So I'm going to put some 5200 in each hole and then get it sealed down. Got little grommets to hold it in place. Okay, we've got the radome, the scan strut, four bolts. They have a little uh, nylon insert that goes in right there. The bolt goes through so it doesn't scratch the powder coat and the uh, uh, gaskets underneath the uh, wires have been uh, caulked in now it's all set now we just got to bolt it in from the bottom and uh, let it dry <laughs>